back once again, sci-fi fans. How's everyone doing? Hope you're doing well. It's Tony back with you again. Um, the five I'm going to have a look at today. Some real cool ones amongst it all. So we'll hit it off with the first one. It's a 101 release um, on the cult movie collection line. And it is Split Second with Root Gahoua. Uh, if you've never seen this film, it is absolutely fucking batshit crazy. Um... Set in the future at the time, it was set in like, I suppose, it was like 2008, I think, uh, in London. London's sort of like under about two foot of water, for I don't know why. Flood defences have given something, I don't know. Rutger Hauer's a really weird police officer that I don't even know what he knows, what he's actually doing. Um, but he's trying to hunt down a serial killer turns out it's some kind of fucking alien monster that kidnaps Kim Cattrall about halfway through it's, it's a weird film weird weird film if you've never seen it you know what I mean, and most Ruger Hauer films are bloody bonkers uh, but this is the most crazy one you'll ever watch but it is quite entertaining there's some decent British actors amongst it as well and I don't know if it's a bad film that's entertaining or the film's really badly edited it seems like that, it seems like the film Whoever edited it had just no idea what it was doing. There's just no sense of right and wrong within it. It just like bounces from one scene to another. It's really weird. Uh, but it's still entertaining. So that's split second. Uh, next up, great little films, Kino release. Um, My Science Project. Uh, if you've never seen this, uh, a young teenage guy finds some old military hardware. Um, and he tries to pass it off as a science project at school and he starts to do weird shit um, really really good entertaining film one of those films I think that enough people, not enough people talk about or probably not enough people have seen um, it is it is really really good fun especially the last 20 minutes last 20 minutes of the film are, are fantastic i won't give anything away uh, but it is really really good it's it, good it's a, it's, a, it's a fun watch so if you've not seen my science project uh, next time it's on sale with kino pick it up for like i think it's like six or seven dollars or something like that grab it you won't be disappointed uh next up's an 88 release uh i love this film i have the post of it up there as well as um it's galaxy of terror i mean look at that artwork Pity none that that's in the fucking film. Um, but there you got a, a, a great little space romp, space horror romp. Um, a, a, again, if you've if you've not seen this film, but you've seen ones I've talked about previously, like in Sevenoid and, and films like that, um, same kind of vein. Um, it wants to be an aliens film. Uh, it wants to be numerous other kind of films. It was put together cheap on a, on a budget and you can tell but it's still really good still really entertaining i love it like i say that i've got this poster up on the wall it's it's fantastic uh one thing i will show you is who the hell did they ever get away with that it's got a fucking x-wing fighter on back you know what i mean um, yeah, no idea how they got away with that but yeah uh nice release that 88 did with this um again if you've not seen it check that out um, next one is the is the big hitter of all time. Everyone knows this one. Uh, this is the VHS range that HMV put out. Uh, it's ET. Uh, what can you say about ET? One of Spielberg's finest. Real feel good film. Um, coming of, coming of age film for the kids. But, but, you know what I mean? It, 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 it's really 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 good. Um, and the second film I ever saw at cinemas, um, which which always sticks with me. Um, what more can you say about it? It's ET. I mean, these range. If you've seen these, these before, these Blu-ray DVD combos that HMV did a, a long while back. You can see them just above me on the shelf up here. Uh, if you go back down into into my other videos, you'll see me talking about these. Uh, if you like the look of those, they're definitely worth a, a look at and a check out. So that's ET. And finally, it's another 101 release on the Black Label limited editions. Uh, it's Howard the Duck yes Howard the fucking Duck I love Howard the Duck um, loads of people hate it it got absolutely fucking sort of like shit thrown all over it when it first came out people despised it people didn't know what the hell it was um, 
I loved every minute of this when I first saw it. I've always loved this film. Um, it's crazy, it's ludicrous, it shouldn't work, it doesn't really work, but it does. Um, fantastic that, that 101 put this kind of treatment, this kind of love to it. Booklets and slip boxes and all kinds of stuff. Um, I think most people would have seen how they're up by now. Uh, and most people can make their own mind up about it. Uh, but for me, personally, I've always loved it, and it's one that I can always go back to. I always find it entertaining. So, the five for this week were... Well, this week, this episode, uh, were Split Second, My Science Project, Galaxy of Terror, E.T. and Howard the Duck. So again, thank you everybody for tuning in. You know what I mean? These these videos are really fun to do and I hope you guys are having fun watching them. Till the next one, take care. I'll see you all again soon. Bye-bye.